everybody, Emma from Kaya Fit OC here. I'm going to talk to you about our health for the holidays workout. So our warm up is going to be 10 minutes. You are going to set up uh, four cones around the room with mini whiteboards. Um, if you have a small gym, maybe this is something you should set up outside. If you have a big, um, huge floor, it's gonna be much better with a uh, good distance to travel. So you're going to write a traveling exercise and a stationary exercise. You're gonna partner up everybody and uh, partner number one is going to be traveling. So our first cone, you're gonna to travel to cone two with butt kickers. So you're gonna kick your booty while partner one is going to stay here at this cone and do squats, okay? So you're waiting for your partner to make it to cone two. Once she arrives at cone two, she'll call your name and then you can take off and go into your butt kickers. At cone two, you will have another set of exercises. Those exercises are going to be monster kicks and dynamic hugs. So our dynamic hugs, we're just hugging big, huge stretches, open up that chest so you can really squeeze those shoulder blades together behind you. And then uh, your cone three is going to be walking lunges to cone four and standing crunches to the front. And then from cone three to cone four, you're doing high knees while partner number one is doing calf raises. And um, you're gonna complete, you're gonna continue to repeat that circuit for eight minutes or 10 minutes. But every minute on the minute, the coach is going to blow the whistle and, and or call out. And you're going to quickly find your partner and do five squat thrusts. Um, and because it's still a warm up, you can step if you'd like. So step and jump high five or just a high reach and get five in. Then you continue through your circuit again, through the four cones. Um, and uh, every time that they restart over at a cone, at cone one, maybe they should switch so um, partner number one and two are alternating. And then um, you're gonna go into round one. So round one is going to be, so this is the center line of our gym. I put the camera so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So th this is the center line of our gym. And you guys are going, to, you're going to set up everybody into partner groups. So they're going to start at the front line, at the center line of your gym. They're going to do an exercise traveling away from each other. Then they're gonna bring it back with a different exercise and meet in the middle for a partner exercise. So our first one is going to be broad jumps away from our partner. So you're going to be facing back to back. You're going to broad jump forward. And then you're going to come back to your partner with a bear crawl. And then from your bear crawl, you'll meet up with your partner and you're gonna do 10 plank high fives. So you, the partners are gonna plank high five, Da, da, da. Once they're done, they're going to come up to standing and they're going to go into their next exercise. So we've got a sprint, you're going to sprint away, and then you're going to duck walk back. So duck walk all the way back to your partner, and you've got 10 squat high fives. So you can add a tippy toe or a jump in the middle if you'd like to, or you can just squat high five. Uh, then you're going to turn around, you're going to broad jump away again. And then you're going to do a walking lunge with a twist. So your walking lunge, you're going to twist towards the leg that's in front, that side, stepping all the way through, twist, step all the way through, twist. When you get to your center line, you're going to uh, do 10 forward back lunge handbag pass. So you and your partner are facing each other. You're both going to um, use your right leg. So one person is going to step forward and pass off the handbag while the other person is stepping back with the handbag. Then they're going to come forward and you're going to step back and you're going to then get the handbag from your partner. Okay. Continue alternating um, with just that one leg um, for five and then you guys can do five on the other. So you end up with ten. Then you're going to go into your sprint again, away, and then you're going to crab walk to your partner. So you're going to come back to your center line, and then from there you're going to do 10 partner tricep dips. So you're already, one partner is going to stay here, 
or she can be down on her bum depending on um, her level of difficulty. Other partners, hands are gonna be on their knees. So if I'm partner number two, my hands are on my knees and I'm doing a tricep dip, okay? It's hard to do when you don't have a partner. <laughs> and then you're gonna do uh, broad jumps away, okay? Again, broad jumps, and then you're going to do 10 tiny fast feet forward into burpee. So your tiny fast feet into burpee, it's gonna look something like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, burpee. Pop up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, burpee. Then when you get to your center line, you and your partner are going to do 10 push-up high fives. So you're gonna be in your push-up position, balance, you can be on your knees. You're gonna push up first, alternate hands, high five. So both right hands start then left hand, okay? Um, that is round one. We're gonna go into round two, which is then you're going to take your partner groups and you're gonna continue to stay with your partner, but you're gonna partner up with another partner group. So then you end up with four people. Um, your partner group is going to run outside and you're gonna go for a 200 meter run. You're gonna come back and Partner number two is, um, or the second partner group is gonna be staying here stationary and is going to do plank uh, to right side plank high fives. So I'm gonna pretend like the wall is my partner. So I'm holding my plank, I'm gonna rotate open, high five my partner and then come back down. I'm gonna continue that same motion, okay, for the entire time that that other partner group is out there, okay? You can also add a little bit more here by high-fiving underneath and coming up and high-fiving at the top, and then you end up staying on that hand that entire time, okay? So that's how you can make it difficult to make it easier. Uh, bottom knee is down, lifting up into that side plank, high-fiving your partner. So you guys are essentially back-to-back -back with each other going into that side plank. Um, you're going to do the same thing for the second one, just on the opposite side. Then we're going to go in.